Stefan Stanchu and this is step by step palm flute lessons. And this one is number six, and we are talking about tonguing and especially about double and triple tonguing. In previous lessons, we have learned how important is the tonguing, how you can change the articulations with it. You can choose to play much more softer, for instance, when you use like do 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 do, or even not using the tonguing, hoo 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 or much more sharper, much more stingier, tu tu tu, or shorter, tu 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 tu. We know how to play now, tu tu tu, du du du, or if you like, ta ta ta, da da da, and so on. But now we should learn how to make also double tonguing. And as I use tu tu tu, double would be ku, tu ku, tu ku, tu ku. While using the tu ku tu ku, we use actually only once the tongue in when we are saying tu tu tu. When we are saying the ku ku ku, actually that's a consonant that makes the same emphasis as a tongue. So when you're saying ku, you should have diaphragm activated and working so that you can make the same effect as with tongue the tu the ku, so that they both are the same level of volume. It's quite difficult to have the ku in the same volume as tu, because when we are saying tu, we already have the emphasizing from the tongue. But in ku, we need much more from diaphragm, ku, 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 and much more accenting the consonant. So if I'm not using correctly with diaphragm, then the tu ku tu ku tu ku tu ku would sound much more like tu ku tu ku tu ku and then it's hearable that it's a double tonguing and in many places that's not such a good thing and then we have triple tongue and that we use usually when we are playing triplets so for instance tu 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 this was with singular unit tu 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 but if you use the triple tongue, that would be tu ku tu tu ku tu tu ku tu tu ku tu tu. And this one is quite good when it's faster tempo. So instead of playing tu 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 with higher tempo, you can use, of course, the singular unit tu 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 tu. But by the time, it might be exhausting to play all the time tu 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 tu, and it would be easier to have tu 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 tu. Now that we know in theory how to use these pronunciations in our mouth tu ku tu ku tu ku, let's try with palm flute. So of course we won't say here but and tu tuku tuku and all the time once again diaphragm activated. So first singular units tu 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 Now the double tongue in tuku tuku. And when the tempo is higher, it's easier to use tuku 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 instead of tu tu tu. So tuku tuku tuku. And now tu tu tu. Of course, once again, if you have a fast, singular tu 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 tongue, use it, but it's exhausting by the time. And then with the triplets. So, first tu 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 tu. Then tu ku tu tu ku tu tu ku tu tu ku tu tu. And 
as the tempo grows, it gets easier. So first we two 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 singular units two. Then two two two. Now let's try to accentuate the first beats. Now with two, 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 it's the same thing, accenting. And two, 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 two. And let's try really fast. So here, we accentate first ones, and then without accenting. In the future lessons, we are also going to learn a little bit more difficult tongues. So, for instance, five in a beat. That would be meaning that two plus three, for instance, in a beat. Or three plus two. Then we would have six, but that's quite easy because it's three plus three. So, then seven, you could choose four plus three. Or three plus four. But more of these in the future lessons. It's time for exercises and samples. Let's start with tongue twisters. And in this one, there are six little exercises, and they are named 1a, 1b, 2a, 2b, 3a, and 3b. And all the A's are just simple, just training the technique, and B's are more melodic ones, but they are in the same level as A. So let's try. We are going to play all the time in this metronome marking 80, but we are going to play every exercise twice. First one will be for beginners in this tempo and then for more advanced flute players in double the tempo. You can use tu 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 or tuku 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 as you feel like. Beginners 1A
advanced. 1B.
some Finnish folk music vibes in this one. First we have in a slower tempo for beginners and then from bar 9 we go higher in the tempo. You can find from my book, for instance, a series of 50 etudes for palm flute, and here is a sample of etude number 25. And notice that how I'm doing with my left hand, right hand, how I'm keeping my hand like this so that I can tilt fast, how is my head tilting also, and hands working. Because this is quite fast and chromatic, so I'm using all of them and at the same time I choose a tempo that I can play both tu 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 and tu ku tu ku and I'm changing them. An exercise from tenor etudes. This series of 10 exercises for palm flute, they all are called by different numbers in different languages. This one is number 5 and it's called Cinch. And Cinch is 5 in Romanian. Now let's try to play this one so that we use both tu 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 and tu ku tu tu ku tu in the same tempo but we can try both of them. <laughs> 